Hello everyone, this is the student example of how to complete the assignment for this week's student orientation. So we're going to click on the assignments page from our team's account. Here we see orientation week, creating tech accounts. You have till Friday at three o'clock to complete it. So our written directions explain the first step is to do the check-in survey, and that's linked here. So once I finish filling out the survey, I'll click submit and go on to step two. Step two says tech accounts. Use the files links to create your tech accounts for this class. So we're just going to go in this order to make sure we do every single one. So the first thing is remind. And I'm going to click this page so that I can see how to do it. So it says sign up for important updates. Um, if you have a smartphone, so that's this here. I have an iPhone. I am going to enter this link in Safari or Google Chrome, whatever you use on your smartphone. And once I do that, I'll follow the directions entering my first name and last name. Or if I don't have a smartphone, I'm simply going to open up my text messaging app and I'm going to type the text message to 81010. And for the message, I'll simply type this code. Once that happens, you'll be given directions to join Remind. And that's it. So close that. Step two is Membean. So we're gonna click on this Membean page. Here it actually gives you opportunity to save your account information. So in order to make sure we save it properly, we're gonna click the three little dots on the side and click open in Word Online. So doing that will make sure our work saves automatically. Okay, so Membean is used for learning vocabulary. The first thing it says we're gonna do is to create an account, open an internet browser in the URL, we're going to type this. So I'm gonna copy that. And I'm gonna open up a new tab on my browser and paste. And let's check what the next step is. The next step says, in the field above, type the class code provided by your teacher. So here's the code, we're gonna copy that. And paste. Okay, let's double check what the next directions are. After we click join your class, then you should see this. Yep, we saw it. Click yes or no, enter your information and make sure you write down your login information. So if we had an account before, we're gonna click yes. And we'll enter that out. Of course, if we forgot our username or password, we're gonna use that. If we've never had an account, we're gonna click no and we'll enter all this information. Before you click create account, make sure you write down the information you used, your username, your password, and the email you used. So for the email, you should be using your school email, which will give you direct access. And then you click create account. So we're done with those directions. All right, next on the list is no red ink. So we're gonna use this form again, click the three little dots, open in Word Online. Okay, so there's two directions here. If you have an account already, you'll simply click the menu bar, go to my classes, and um, enter the code there. You'll see the code is down at the bottom. If you've never had an account, then we're going to copy this link into our browser. So new tab, copy, paste. I'm a student. Okay, now it says we have to enter our code. Let's double check what it is. And here it is. So we're going to copy this. And paste. Okay, same thing, we're gonna enter all our information before we click sign up. 
we're going to make sure we write down our username, password, and recovery email that we included in the sign-up directions. And then you'll know you're done when you get this message. All right. Next is Common Lit. So we're going to click the three little dots, open in Word Online. And very similar, we're going to copy in the link to our web browser. Okay, it's asking for a class code. So it says once we see that message, we're going to copy in the code. And press submit. Okay, so we're going to enter in the information before we click set up though, we're going to make sure we write down our username and password. And that's it. All right, last step is achieve 3000. So try logging in with your old account or please message me if you need to, if you need me to send you one. So for that, we're going to go to achieve3000.com. We're gonna click login at the top. Here's a nice option, forget your password if you don't remember your username and password. If you've never used this website before, please message me. Um, you can send me a Teams chat, you can send me an email, and I can set up an account for you. Or if you're really having trouble forgetting, remembering your password, you can also message me and I will send you your account information. All right, so it looks like that's it. To confirm that you've finished everything, you'll click turn in and you'll have until Friday at 3 p.m. to do so. Thanks.